In this video lecture, we're going to cover MIDI recording using external devices in Logic Pro 10. So let's get started. The first thing you're going to do is create a new track. So go over here to the plus sign, create a new track. Now, as you can see here, we're going to need a software instrument. And you're going to want to make sure that your output device is Fast Track Pro. Of course, make sure you have your left and your right here for your output. And just push Create. Now, I want you to also think about MIDI again, okay? I'm going to go ahead and give you another refresher on this. What I'm doing is I'm using my external keyboard, which is my Phantom X6, as a MIDI controller to control the sounds in Logic Pro. I have a digital audio interface which is the middleman, basically, to connect the keyboard to the computer, okay? And so what I need to do is make sure that within Logic Pro, my Fast Track Pro digital audio interface is on the right channel, okay? So let me show you how to do that. If you have a different brand, that's fine. You just want to make sure you find your digital audio interface in your software program over here. So go over here to Logic Pro X, Go to Preferences, then Audio. And then what you're going to look over here, make sure you have Devices selected. You're going to go to Output Device. Make sure that you select your digital audio interface. For me, it's a Fast Track Pro. And your Input Device, you want to make sure that's also Fast Track Pro. And that's um, really it. It's very simple. Also, make sure your buffer size is either 256 or 1 over 28. Okay, or excuse me, 128. All right. You don't want it to be one uh, the, the, the largest amount. OK, or, or you're going to run into some latency issues. Click apply changes. And you're, you're ready to go. OK. And the rest is really just pushing record and recording either some chords or recording some drum sounds after you selected the instrument that you want. OK. So let's just go ahead and get started with something. I'm going to, you know, come in over here. Actually, I'm going to do this orchestra here. And we're, yeah, we'll do the harp. All right. Now I'm going to go over here to window here and bring up this keyboard just so you can see what I'm playing. And I'm going to just play off the top. All right, we're going to do that. In the next lecture, we're going to cover MIDI recording using the piano roll. Thanks for watching.